Hello, Andrew Lynch here from Andrew Lynch Golf and today we're looking at two very famous instructors Ernest Jones, Manuel de la Torre. Manuel passed away uh, last year and uh, both fantastic coaches. Manuel's father, Angel, learnt the technique of Ernest Jones uh, uh, who uh, was basically, he had a log, leg blown off in the uh, First World War and it made him look for a better swing technique. Uh, and this swing technique was so good that when he showed it to the PGA of America at their annual show, uh, they said, we can't teach that because our pros won't make enough money. It's too simple. It can't be that simple. So really what Ernest talked about was that if we have a good grip, a good stance and a good posture, all things that are static, they're quite easy to work on those, but a lot of people don't. If you have those things and you basically, the intelligence is in the hands. If you take away the club, um, your body is passive. So when it, give, when it wants to give, it gives. Your shoulders turn because the club is moving. And so with a passive body and your hands in charge, your body will make all the movements that it needs to do. And what usually ruins a swing, as we've all seen, is those people that take a nice practice swing and then they kind of get to the top and they do this. That's not swinging the golf club. And the emphasis on both Ernest and Manuel's technique is to swing the golf club. Now you're going to see me hit you on some pitches uh, and some full uh, seven irons, uh, slow speed, normal speed, using this technique. And it's been a little bit of an eye opener for me because when you practice this, it really shows you where, and it, it, for me, it's in transition. I tighten up a little bit in transition and that's where it goes wrong because I'm just kind of taking over when I should just be letting the club swing back. Uh, so I'm getting quite a lot from this uh, and I think you would as well. Uh, Ernest Jones' book is available online, I think it's a PDF. Manuel de Dottori's book is available on Amazon as a book or as I think a download. So both good books. Now what uh, the difference between Manuel's and Ernest's technique is Manuel decided that on the backswing it was the hands and on the downswing it was the arm from here that controlled the swing. Uh, I kind of like agree with that I do believe because I find that if I just think about taking this club up and then from here I like to just hold that not um, when I say hold it I don't try and do anything from there all I'm trying to do is rotate through I get a really nice shot uh, but and with the the hands being in control the whole time which Surprisingly enough, Seve Ballesteros was a big hands player uh, and he was Spanish as well. Uh, so, uh, you know, it, it does work, this stuff. Uh, but I really like this technique because there's not a whole lot of moving parts to remember. Uh, I had a student once who had like 10 things to remember before he got the club just about halfway back. Uh, and obviously, you can't play golf that way. So we changed him a lot uh, and he's still playing golf and really enjoying it. So this technique is a more flowing technique and I think you'll get a lot from this. If you're one of those guys though that loves to break the swing down into little compartments, I mean, and it's 1.5 seconds of swing, so kind of good look to you on that, then you're not gonna enjoy this because you're gonna think, well, it can't be that easy. But it is really, let's face it, we don't buy a book on how to throw a ball. We just, we learn how to throw a ball. You know, there's there's not a book on how to punch, you know what I mean? We just know that it's a relaxed arm and move. Throw a ball, relax, throw, you know. It, but in golf we do 
overcomplicate, I believe, the swing. And that's what is refreshing about the Ernest Jones and the Manuel de la Torre technique. Whether you're a whole hands player or a hands and then an arms coming down, I think you'll get uh, a lot from reading these books. And so I suggest you do. I'm going to uh, post a couple more videos about this, about how you know I go along, because obviously I'm using the Dante kind of hinge, uh, and uh, then the rest is kind of like Ernest Jones uh, technique. So try this. I think you'll like it. Check the swings out. And uh, from Andrew Lynch Golf, trying to keep it really simple, over and out. If you like this, press the like and subscribe for more simple videos to get better at golf. Take care. Bye.